Greetings everyone, this is Alaya from the Light Dimensions of the Pleiades. In order to help Earth in the transformation process, I had to accommodate myself to the lower Earth frequencies. For this reason, I have divided my consciousness in two bodies. I am living at the same time here and on a spaceship in a higher frequency. In the higher light levels, I am a time traveler of light. This is normal there, because everything is possible with divine energy. Me and other members of the Galactic Federation of Light are here to help you to develop your heart and consciousness. I filmed some of our spaceships and I show them to you in part 8 of my videos. Every day I am receiving mails from people who met me in the Asa plane. It makes me happy when they are writing me how lightful they are live their lives after seeing my videos. This is the love energy that planet Earth needs. Earth is in an energy transformation process and love is the key to a smooth transformation. The highest truths are simple, clear and not complicated. When you listen to information about the universe and extraterrestrials, always investigate with your soul and your higher self from which source they are coming and what energy they have. If those informations last for hours and are making you tired, it's because you are losing energy. Those informations are not coming from a lightful source, but from the dark side, trying to distract you from what is most important, the development of your heart and spirituality. The informations of lightful beings are giving you energy and you feel charged, awake and powerful. Spiritual people who had real experience with the light are talking with the quality of love and emotion in their voice and their aura is lightful. Rational people who have only informations in their heads are talking like a machine with no emotion or spiritual energy in their voice. Rational earth people think like a robot and expect that all higher things have to be complicated. They are more interested in negative aliens, disasters, manipulations, prophecies, false stories from the past and less in the spiritual development of the heart. So don't let them distract you. High light beings are talking short and direct, telling you how to activate love in your heart. We are telling you useful information that can help you to develop spirituality. We are telling the truth as it is, without judging anyone. Negative people don't understand this divine simplicity of love and are insulting and judging light workers because they can't stand the energy of love and truth. My love is beyond the comprehension of those people. They don't understand it because they don't listen to their heart. They are listening to negative astral beings who are manipulating them. With my love energy, I have defensed myself a few times from evil grey and reptilian aliens and black helicopters from the secret world government. They can't stand the love frequency. Don't let yourself be distracted and confused by negative people. Don't waste your time on web pages where negative people are insulting others with rude, evil words and then still claim to be spiritual or intelligent. The negative energy those people are creating is damaging your energy field and your cells in your body and you stay in a low frequency where no love is and no light. Send them love, forgive them and then look for people with a high consciousness. If you connect with the love of the existence you will activate spirituality and you will have your own spiritual experiences. Then you have real knowledge without being distracted from insanity and confusion. Only with love you can recognize love. With hate and arrogance you don't see love and attack love. Keep your energy on a high loving frequency. Remove everything around you that has a negative vibration and that is harming you. Stay away from negative fanatic people 
who don't accept love. They are possessed by many low astral entities. You can see it in their aura. Remove negative books about wars, grey aliens, draconians, abductions. Remove dark negative posters and replace them with colorful friendly posters. Remove dark clothes. Don't watch evil movies and don't listen to evil music with demonic words. Keep your spirit and body free from hate and smoke poison. This is damaging your aura and you vibrate in a low frequency and you can't reach the light of the higher dimensions. With a low frequency you can only live in the lower dimensions. If you have a broken leg you can't climb a mountain. You have to heal yourself first. Only light can stay in the light. People who don't master the ability to love in this lifetime will get the chance in the next life on another planet. That is the natural way of evolution, the learning process of the soul. Everybody decides for himself how fast or slow he wants to learn. Everybody is responsible for his own life, his thinking and doing. The key to the higher dimensions is love, the love frequency in your heart, love for yourself, for others and for the nature. Love is the key to communicate with spiritual extraterrestrials. If you see a spaceship in the sky, try to feel what energy it has. If it is radiating love energy, it is one of ours. We see every thought and every emotion. If it comes to a purification on the Earth, the Galactic Federation of Light would evacuate with different ships, because not everybody has the necessary frequency to go in light ships. So we have physical ships too, with a lower frequency. This is only a possibility. We would like to see a smooth transformation. And many people who are manipulated by the dark side want rather a chaotic transformation than a smooth one. That's why those people get angry when they hear that there are many possibilities for the future. If enough people would create love energy, the transformation would be smooth. But if most people create negative energies, the planet will go through a deep purification and only spiritual people will be prepared. Therefore, it is important to have a high consciousness to be prepared for every situation.